All right, as we begin week three of distant learning, I wish you guys could be here. I am currently isolating in Vermont and I have this beautiful pond habitat. It's pretty tiny. It's only about, let's say, 10 feet in diameter and a ton of frogs in here. Everybody, if you could just be quiet for a moment and just listen. Stop, please. Okay, I asked you to please stop. We're just gonna listen for a minute. Okay, you could hear them. I'm gonna walk around to the other side so you get an idea. Okay. Oh yes, my children found the eggs, which are the size of poppy seeds. Yeah, I spotted them. And we did. Froglets also. Okay, we might not. The froglets don't come until after the eggs hatch. Uh, so we talked about the life cycle. Yesterday. And we start, yep, we started talking about the fact that the eggs, I don't know if you guys can see it, I'm gonna try to zoom in, but they look like little poppy seeds. They might even be embryos at this point. Um, I can't tell, I'd have to take it out in, with the microscope. Um, but if you look, I think that these eggs, are, these uh, frogs are actually beginning to mate. There's a bunch of them, that's why they're so loud too. They're making a lot of noise. I'm gonna zoom around, see if I can get a better angle so you guys could see them. I wish you could be here, all my students. This is a very cool, like, virtual field trip you're taking. And it's also in a, um, it's in Green Mountain. Yep, we're in the Green Mountains of Vermont, yep. Whoa, like more, what was that? More than 10 hundred frogs. Well, I would, uh, good, okay. We would, we're gonna try to do it accurately. There's probably about, 50 frogs here, and you could definitely hear them. I'm thinking 100. I got a, I over here. Especially with all these eggs that are gonna hatch. The eggs are pretty cool. I only saw that one set of eggs over there, but maybe there'll be more. Probably it's gonna, um, probably, um, it's gonna take like about Oh, I think two those two are mating right there. I wonder if I can zoom in on that. Guys, Hold on. Shh. I saw a Those daddy. two? Look at that. Please be quiet. Thank you. Yep. I think the croaking is a sign. Yep. Shh. Please stop doing that, Justin. We don't want to disturb the pond habitat. So. I'm gonna check back in with the pond tomorrow. Today is Monday, April 6th, and we'll check back in to see the status of the pond habitat. There's so many over there. Happy spring, everyone.